Here at UNMC in the Clinical Movement Analysis Lab, one of our main goals is to better understand the long-term outcomes of knee injuries. ACL injuries are unfortunately an increasingly common problem in young, very active people who are playing sports. Despite these people being able to get back to playing sport, evidence shows that they are at a very high risk for developing knee arthritis. Our ACL research team is dedicated to making sure that patients have the best outcomes possible for both the short and long-term health of the knee. We really believe that the way you move matters, and this might be even more important after an ACL injury. In the Clinical Movement Analysis Lab, we use 3D motion analysis and research-grade testing to capture precise measurements about how a person moves following surgery. We also use state-of-the-art MRI imaging to monitor the health of the cartilage in the knee. All of this information provides unique insight into the rehabilitation process that is really above and beyond what is typical in a normal clinical setting. What I enjoyed about the data collection process was um, being able to see the markers and how they were placed on me and then going through and doing the different exercises, being able to see the, the data that was on the computer and being able to see how um, the body motions went through while I was doing the different exercises. We really believe that ACL recovery is about being able to get back to sports, maintain an active lifestyle, but also really about the long-term health of your knee over time. Ultimately, our goal is to identify modifiable factors, like the way people move or the strength of their knee, that affects how well they recover after ACL injury, and develop rehabilitation programs that can prevent knee arthritis after these injuries. Well, I think we're really fortunate here because we have a tremendous team when it comes to this sort of work in terms of biomechanics, radiology with expertise in cutting edge MRI, uh, physical therapy, athletic training, and sports medicine, and we really work well together as a team. And the study has definitely benefited me um, um, in many ways, being able to see the progress that I've been making since even before the injury, the two-month mark, the four-month mark, the six-month mark, being able to see that progress and having, you know, definitive data and definitive numbers that say, hey, this is where I was at you know, right after the surgery and here is where I'm at now. 